Hi Capricorn, welcome to my channel. This reading for today Capricorn, this is a collective tarot reading session for you Capricorn. I hope you are doing well. I hope you're fine and safe and doing good. This reading for today Capricorn, this is a collective uh, tarot reading message for you. Let us see what is coming towards you in love, career, money, and general situationship, okay? Thank you guys for your support. Thank you guys for your patience. This reading for today, this is a four. The sign of Capricorn. Let us see what is coming towards you, alright? So, um, this reading for today, I am channeling the month of August up until the month of September, okay? This is valid for the next 30 days. Let us see what's coming towards you. Ooh, why do you have a seven of swords? What is coming towards you in love, career, money, and general situationship? So the first part of the reading will be looking into your focus, your situation, your overall energy, and let us see who is coming towards you in love, career, money, and general situationship. Oh, the hidden energy is the Knight of Cups. You have the star card. You could be dealing with an Aquarius, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy. Let us start your reading. Sorry guys, I'm still, you know, I'm recovering from a very bad cough. But I am getting better. And thank you for your patience. Let us start your reading. So you're starting the reading with a Seven of Swords. The Seven of Swords, the Four of Cups, the Ten of Swords. Um, there has been some people or situation or moment in time, Seven of Swords, where it looks like you're not listening to your intuition, Capricorn. Because um, if you look at the White Horse, look at that, it is Pegasus. I feel like Pegasus in here, it is reminding you, Hey, Capricorn, I am reminding you that before you do that, you spend that, you say that, please reflect and have a self-assertive, like switch into self-reflection and self-assertion, okay? Because I'm telling you right now, you have been naughty, okay? Or I would say you have been warned or somehow your higher self is telling you don't engage don't do this avoid this but you still went on okay um because the ten of swords this is like if you look at the guy he is downwards and there's a lot of swords so maybe you were something obvious happened like something hits you in your face and it's obviously they're not being loyal to you or consistent to you the way you are to them okay um four of cups i feel like you you've been warned i feel like your higher self is telling you capricorn to be a little bit selfish because they're taking advantage of you and somehow your kind-hearted vibe let them in um, engage and they ended up disappointing you um, but the thing is <sighs> excuse me <coughs> <coughs> the vibe in here Capricorn it's not to like blame you it is somehow mistakes in the past it is lesson learned so what you need to do oh yeah look at that eight of pentacles Something tells me you kind of need to be on your own right now. Like something tells me that maybe at work, like money matters, you know. Something connected to giving money, giving time, giving your forgiveness or spending time. You might be better off on your own, you know. Because how many times will you allow them to do this or to do that? It's not great. It's not a great feeling to be, um, it's not a great feeling to be sidelined, breadcrumbs, or not appreciated. So, 
it's about time to be a little bit selfish and conserve your money, your energy, put all of your interest to you. Because I don't think they're very, very reciprocal of what you're giving. Like this is definitely, you're giving 80%, they're giving 20%, which is far, far from, yeah, look at that. You don't even feel how much they're giving you. For some of you guys, you're wishing, you know, for some of you Capricorn, you're even wishing that, I wish they would give me 30%, you know? You would even willing to somehow compromise. You know what? I'm okay if they give me this, they give me that. But they give you less of what you expected less. So it's a total a disappointment, okay? But it's lesson learned. This is a reading where now you know, okay? So before you engage with this person or situation, you're being advised to self-reflect or be assertive and tell them that you've got your boundaries, okay? You've got, they've reached the limit, okay? Seven of Pentacles, Eight of Pentacles in here. This is not the first time. You forgive them, you have forgiven them last year, last month, April, um, July, and still, they manage to sneak or they manage to do same thing. Now that person, that situation, this could be this could be like a this could be connected to work. This could also be connected to um could be connected to family or work or money. It could also be connected to relationship because there's a four of cups in here. Um it could be a mixed, you know, it could be a mixed of Maybe you notice, Capricorn, that you've been so, you've been so, how do I word that? Like you've, not, you've noticed that people tend to, um, like when it comes to them, you prioritize. But when it comes to you needing their support, you're always the last one. Like you're easy to, how do I, not manipulate, but more of, if I ask favor, let's go to Capricorn, you're so easy to give the favor. But when you ask for favor for other people, it feels like you have to sell your soul to get their attention, respond, reply, which is not fair. You make it so easy for them. They're so complicated with small things, text, reply, you know, attention, support. So now you know your place. And because you know your place to them, now you would have to rank them below because they rank you below. Okay, this reading. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. So, now, so I'm kind of picking up that this is a mixture of money, um, family, uh, work, and romantic relationship in here. Now, the next 10 days, they will, like, if you if you stop giving, like if you ignore, um, if you ignore, like if you stop thinking about them, they will feel your detachment. And one by one, the following people will resurface. Six of Wands, Ace of Swords, okay? Like once you stop thinking about them, there is some sort of, they will feel your interest. It has, it's gone. They will feel that. United of Wands. Once you start, once you stop thinking about them, talking to them, calling them, or giving them attention, once you stop that, because this is you walking away, you're putting your interest to yourself, to your world, um, they will fight for your attention. Yeah. There's someone online. There's someone, sorry guys, I'm chewing like a um, strap seals. So, there is, this could be like a family member or a romantic interest. They will say sorry. This person will say sorry. There is an apology that you would see in your social media app online. Five of Wands. I feel like if you, I feel like if you're being ignored, like if there was a situation in, at work, 
or at home at work because eight of pentacles this is like eight to five job or this is where you stay more than eight hours so it could be at home at work um so a friend or a romantic interest will resurface online and they will say sorry and of course they would like to reconcile with you depending on your respond and then in the next three seven ten days the five ones you're you're gonna start to get attention via work okay if in the past you get breadcrumbs you get you know for some of you you're not getting thank you you're not being complimented that will change I feel like the more you keep quiet the more you go underground you keep quiet underground you just stay quiet work hard work hard keep quiet um, that is where you get the notification because five of wands so someone at work will hey now they will compen compensate you I'm kind of picking that up <coughs> you know what at work they should have done that a long time ago I feel like you're not properly compensated at work now if you push back and say I cannot do it it's not part of my role or maybe someone is asking you money someone asking you favor sorry sorry if you could push it then they will realize how much you were giving to them because they didn't know that they were asking a lot until you said no okay and things with a star card and eight of wands this is where you will get them to see you and your real value if you keep saying no that is where things would change for you and they will see your real value in here you know there's a part of you that some people made you insecure some people made you insecure or made you feel um self-limiting belief because i don't know i'm kind of picking up in here capricorn situation at work where i'm senior but i'm not getting this attention i'm not getting this work i should be doing that you know your input is very very needed your value in the team or at work is very um impeachable impeachable so maybe because you were okay to be getting all of this or doing this for them like i'm kind of picking up the old way you always doing a favor for other people and when it comes to your time you, they don't do it so something tells me with the eight of wands the rhythm the rhythm the pattern it would change by simply saying no just say no and things will you will you will earn respect you will be paid properly if you keep saying no because in this reading you are the supplier if you cut the supply they would they will they will have, they will fall out especially at work you have to say no you have to stop doing work for other people okay so this is your reading capricorn self reflection self self-reflection and self-assertiveness is very needed for you in the next three seven ten days i will see you soon you have a great day